Okay, Coach, can you talk about your men winning the heptathlon and uh, setting your guys up for uh, the two-day lead? Well, when you get 21 points in one event, you, you got to feel good, you know, and uh, we're going to need every point we can get uh, tomorrow during the finals. Uh, you know, UT San Antonio uh, came over from the Southland Conference with us, and they're set, they won the Southland Conference Championship seven times in a row. They're going to be a tough team to beat. Uh, we got a lot of kids in the finals. Uh, we got a lot of events, events ahead of us that we're uh, – that we can do really well in. You know, Utah State and Idaho are strong teams as well, so it's going to be a real battle tomorrow. Uh, you know, it's always nice, you know, when you, when you get a, a, a first event lead like that, it takes a lot of pressure off the athletes and enables them to perform well. So we're looking forward tomorrow, to tomorrow. Oh, yeah, thank you and good luck. Okay, thanks. Coach Boone, can you just talk about uh, coming in after last night with the point lead and uh, setting you guys up, your women's team up for uh, the two-day lead? Well, you know, one of the things that we talked about is making sure that someone starts a spark that would ignite a fire, and the Maltese definitely did that. Um, we had some injuries in that group, but they stepped up big, and, and so we were really excited, and it gave us the energy we needed to come in today. And the field did, the field did a phenomenal job today, from the weight throw to the, um, to the high jump was big for us today. Um, pole ball came up big as well. So it, we put ourselves in a good position, and we just want to continue to compete. Okay, thank you, and good luck.